Hi everyone, so this video is just about uh, showing you all the elements for the actual stream of the Thanks Gaming Invitational, what things you can see and how we are going to utilize the Docomo branding on the, uh, on the actual internet that night on social media, right? So um, we have a couple of scenes like the, these are like before the actual uh, stream starts, the stream will go live, this, this, this uh, scene will pop up, you know, has a Docomo logo. Um, if there's ever a lull in the game and we have to take a break from the monitoring stream, there's this page. Um, and of course, there's a stream ending. And then there's an offline, right? So those are, those are the simple elements, right? Um, but obviously, there's a lot of games being played, so we have elements for, for those. So for instance, right here, we have the game. Docomo logo pops up. We get this little info stuff about the game on the bottom and then you know switches to Docomo Pacific Headquarters, Thanks Gaming Invitational, casted by Ken and, and Shado Barry, um, you know, and with more Docomo Pacific branding, the GUFGC and then my logo there, right? And on the top we'll have the players, right? So this is this is the screen that will probably be shown uh, most often, right? Um, obviously because of the nature of a gaming tournament right there's a lot of games so uh that that'll be the main screen but we also have a um alternate screen and this will this is the screen that pops up in between matches so obviously people play then they lose and then we have to get two more people to get onto the screen uh get onto the stream so during that lull during that downtime we we'll talk about the people who are coming up to play or the old match uh, this is the screen that people see, and then we have a bunch of um, elements that go on top of this, right? So um, one of the elements is um, something like this, this alternate overlay. Um, and we put the game there, and then we on the left where it says Thanks Gaming Invitational, this will be a webcam that shows the commentators or interviews with the player or interviews with the Docomo staff, right? And then, as you can see on the rest of the thing, you have the live from Docomo Pacific Headquarters at, up, the t uh, up at the top, catch Fortnite and other games, like our Facebook page, links below. Uh, you are watching the Thanksgiving Invitational on the bottom. And both of those things change, right? They change every 15 to 20 seconds. Um, so there's that. And then we also have... Um, cool little overlays for a bunch of the players. Um, bunch of different things right so we have a team team tournament thing like this is obviously this is fake we're not gonna do a team thing like this but uh, if you wanted to implement that we could um, and this part is more of checking the player information but if you want to see it you can see it so like for instance we have Tomas All right we have this little profile about Tomas that we talk about um, him as a player or whatnot and he, as he gets ready and then we go to his opponent and you know it has all this information about Joe Garrido it's a little, he's from Sinahania blah 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 and we have this for every player that's playing in the Invitational right um, so so that's pretty cool and then that's a good way to, to personalize um, the players and get people at home uh, interested in, you know, something that they can relate to so that, um, you know, maybe they can come down to Docomo and play one, day, one time, you know. And I think, uh, you know, it brings a level of professionalism to, to the stream and the quality because uh, this type of production is not really done um, in other tournaments. Um, but, you know, we're going to do it here for this one. So... Um, yeah, I think I think that's gonna work out. Uh, it's a good way to help Docomo with uh, branding and establishing themselves as a big supporter of esports and gaming in general. And like you know, we're taking this one to the next level, I think, pretty much. But um, you know, these are pretty cool, right? So mm. so that's pretty much it. Um, yeah, you know, we have we have more of these. So obviously we're, we're making 16 of these, right? One for every player in the tournament or in the two tournaments. Um, 
so got my work cut out for me a bit because we still got to do a bunch of those but um yeah you know that's it it's, it's, it's pretty cool excited about saturday um we have a lot of uh things that we can we can do here so yep let me know if you feel like information needs to be changed or moved or, or whatnot i can see what i can do or if the branding placement is weird uh you know i'll, I'll figure it out like uh, this is this is the one right this is the main one like using this gray circle with the white docomo pacific logo um simply because i don't have uh you know that's the only logo i was given so uh that, that's what we're running with and i try to keep uh, the red very similar to the docomo red with a little gradient on it and then you know we, we have a lot of docomo branding so um yeah that's the stream uh, tell me what you think